All right, adventurers, welcome to All Play. We're here with more of the Pokemon Soul Silver Nuzlocke. Listen, we are in the final stage of this Soul Silver Nuzlocke, ladies and gentlemen. After this, that's it. We, we're going to do, we are going to participate in the League Challenge. We'll be taking on the Elite Four. We take on all four members, one after another. We don't have a chance to leave. We don't have a chance to come back for anything, all right? So before we do that, I have to reintroduce our team. I have to reintroduce Team Snaps and Claps because I did change the team up just a little. Let's go ahead and start with our leader, Perry, the brave Empoleon. He's holding, where is he? Oh, he's holding the amulet coin so that we'll double our money as long as we send out Perry. His ability is Torrent. When his health drops to less than a third, uh, water type moves will be increased in damage. And that's good because his moveset is Whirlpool, Aqua Jet, Surf, and Metal Claw. Perry, you and I have ran this team from the very beginning. It got to a point where you were the only one left, and then we brought the team back. I am very grateful to have run this far with you, Perry. Next up, we have Dawn, the modest Hariyama. She's holding the wide lens. I forget what the wide lens does. Well, we can check that in a hot second. Uh, her ability is Guts. If she has a status problem, her attack goes all the way up. Her moveset, Smelling Salt, Force Palm, Waterfall, and Vital Throw. Remember, the combination of Smelling Salt and Force Palm, if Force Palm can inflict paralysis, is amazing. It should kill. It should kill if I can go Force Palm Smelling Salt. Dawn, thank you for being a huge, huge part of this team. No pun intended. I'm very grateful to have run this far with you. Stop that. I'm trying to introduce you. This is Smells the Hardy Skun Tank. He's hard headed. He likes farting all the time. He's holding the charcoal. I realize I never gave him a hold on him. That's probably why. Uh, his fire attack isn't that strong. Charcoal increases the damage that fire type moves will deal. His ability is Stench. It has no effect in battle. That's all right. This Stench helps keep wild Pokemon away. And that's fine. S Smells has done his job thus far. Uh, his moveset, Toxic, Flamethrower, Night Slash, and Slash. Smells is my boy for the, the crits. When, whenever I need a crit, I go to, I go to Smells. Because he'll come through with both Slash and Night Slash. Smells, I am very grateful to have you on this team thus far. I just wish you would stop farting every time I send you out. Next up, we have Scavenger, the modest Raticate holding the Silk Scarf. Uh, its ability also has nothing to do with battle. It ensures that we are able to run away from wild Pokemon, so it's not going to be useful here against four trainers in a row. That's all right. Scavenger's move set: we have Fly, Crunch, Super Fang, and Mud Shot. I just realized we can probably take Silk Scarf off of Scavenger because Super Fang always does exactly half the damage. Rounded down, I believe it is. So Silk Scarf is not doing anything. Silk Scarf boosts uh, the damage that normal type moves deal. It'll be all right. I'll switch it out. Scavenger, I am so grateful to have had you on our team thus far. You've put in so much work. So much work. I have, I have respect for Eradicate now. Next up, we have Victoria, the Jolly Venusaur. She's holding the Miracle Seed, which will boost grass type attack. Uh, grass attack types. We're just going to roll past that one. Uh, her moves, her ability is Overgrow. The same way. Parries was Torrent, and it will increase water-type moves if he drops to third health or less. Victoria's grass-type attacks will increase in damage if she drops to a third health or less. Her moveset, Strength, Growth, Sleep Powder, and Razor Leaf. Victoria, I am very grateful to have had you on my team thus far. Keep being, keep being you. And next, we're introducing a new member of the team. This is Queen, the Brave Altaria. We got... Uh, uh, we got Swab Blue a while ago, and I had to switch out Lucky, our shiny Soul Rock, because as great as Lucky was, I don't think we really even used Lucky. Also, there's a couple bases that we need to cover for our team. One of them is that we don't have anybody not susceptible to ground type attacks. That's where Queen comes in. She's Dragon and Flying type. Also, we now have something that can deal with dragons in the event that one comes up. 
Queen's ability is natural cure. All status problems heal when it switches out. So if she gets paralyzed, poisoned, burned, whatever, when we switch her out, and then if, if we bring her back, she'll be cured. She won't have any more problems. Her moveset, Dragon Breath, Astonish, Dragon Dance, and Fly. Uh, I gave her the zoom lens. If she goes second, if she doesn't go first, uh, she will have a higher critical hit ratio. Which is good because her speed is very low. That's honestly the only thing I don't like about Altaria is their speed is really low unless you train them for speed. Queen, I can't say thank you for being on the team thus far, but I'm glad to have you here with us for this run against the Elite Four. Uh, let's see. Let's switch out Scav's item before I forget. We'll take that silk scarf from you, buddy. And let's see. What are we going to give you? What are we going to give you? What's something good to, to give Scavenger? Wise glasses. It boosts, it boosts the power of special type moves. She, I don't think she has special type. She does have physical, though. So we can give her that one item that's the polar opposite. That's that muscle band? Yes. We'll give her muscle band. Or give him muscle band. Excuse me. So if we look at... Oops. I can't fly in here. Let's, let's look at her moveset one more time. Just make sure. Okay, so we have Fly, which is a physical attack. We have Crunch, which is a physical attack. Super Fang, we can't boost that. And Mud Shot is special. Okay, that's fine. Two, two are getting a boost as opposed to none. I'm down with that. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. That is our team. That is who we're running to the Elite Four. I should say running through the Elite Four with. <sighs> this is going to be the longest hour of my life. <laughs> I think I said that as I started against the Leap Four of Fire Red as well. Okay, guys, once again, this is it. Once we go through that door up there, there's a door. Let's, no, I'm not answering. I'm not answering the phone right now. Stop calling me. I'm, I'm about to do a thing. I'm about to do a thing. Uh, once we go through this door here, past this gentleman, there is no turning back. There's no turning back. We either become the champion of the Johto region or we lose the Nuzlocke. Team Snaps and Claps, let's, let's do this one for the boys back home, all right? A lot of people, a lot of lives have been lost to get us here. Let's do this. Once you enter this door, you will be facing one of the Elite Four. They are really tough. You cannot exit once you enter. Are you ready? Be courageous and go for it. All right. So I don't think I explained it. The Elite Four, just like the gem leaders are supposed to have a specific type that they're good with, the Elite Four also are supposed to have a specific type they're good with. Each of them, their own type. The first, it looks like, should be a psychic. Not entirely sure. Let's see. Welcome to the Pokemon League. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Will. I have trained all around the world, making my psychic type Pokemon powerful. I know my game. I know my game. And at last, I have been accepted into the Elite Four. I can only keep getting better. Losing is not an option. All right, here goes the first battle of the Elite Four. Here's Will. All right, he's got five. We have six. Carnivine is up first. Of course. Of course. Perry can't catch a break. I'm so sorry, Perry, but you gotta you gotta sit this one out. This is not your fight. Smells. I think I want smells. Oh, this thing does not have earthquake. I'm super scared of it having earthquake. It knows crunch, okay. And we hold. Alright. So Carnivine, we can catch it with a tox ooh, do we want toxic yeah, let's toxic it and then flamethrower. We'll toxic then flamethrower. I'm not entirely sure if Flamethrower by itself will take Carnivine out, but two rounds of Toxic and then Flamethrower definitely should. It's adding its defense, which is okay because we're using special defense. We're using special defense. So there's one. The next Toxic Poison, Poisoning, will do double damage. So Flamethrower, as long as Flamethrower pushes it towards the end, as far to the end as it can get. Come on. All right. It's not, it's not as far as we need it, but that works. There's spit up. Come on. Hold it. Hold it, smells. There we go. All right. And then the next move will kill it. The next move definitely will. Oh, no. He's going to heal. <laughs> how did I know? How did I know he was going to heal? I can't even tell you how I do. All right. But that's okay because toxic damage is now dealing... 
I think three times as much. I'm not sure if it's three times or four times. I don't think it keeps doubling. Ooh, look at that. Look at all that. Oh, no. He used full restore. He didn't just use a potion. He used full restore. Okay, that's fine. You're still dead. Good work, Smells. Smells, you did it. You did this one, Smells. Good work. Come on. And Waylord. Okay, now we got a challenge here. Waylord is a, a large whale. It's water type, so we're going to Victoria. I am not doubting Victoria's ability. I am not doubting Victoria's strength, but I don't think Victoria could take Waylord out in one shot. It is a tanky Pokemon. It is very tanky. Come on. Damn! Ooh, look at that crit, though. Ooh, that crit, though. Good work, Victoria. Prove it me wrong. I like when my team proves me wrong. Slow King. Okay, so it's it's a trend so far. He has nothing but very tanky Pokemon. Very tanky Pokemon. Victoria, you got this. Slow King is water type and psychic type. You got this, Victoria. Come on. All right, that's good. That's all right. Nasty plot. All right. Who is that special? Yeah, special attacks up. All right, here we go. My team doing it. My team is doing it today. Go ahead, team. Snap some claps. Yeah. Come on. Doing good. Doing good. An Amber Palm. All right. Guess whose turn it is, Dawn. I actually like Dawn. I'm not going to lie. I like Dawn. I get happy when I send Dawn out. Come on. Come on. Come on. Amber Palm is normal type. So we're going to force palm it. Nasty plot. They all have nasty plot. Oh, I don't think Amber Palm is tanky. He might he might go into the red on this, which means he'll probably heal. Come on. Oh, it took him down. Go ahead, Dawn. Go ahead, Dawn. I'm proud of you. Proud of you. Come on. Last one. Jump Luff. Ah, Jump Luff. Let's send out Scav. <laughs> this has been Scav's thing the entire time, taking out the Hope Hip line. Go ahead, Scavenger. All right, there's Jump Luff. It is Grass and Flying type. We Psychics don't give up even when we're down to the last Pokemon. That's what makes us so formidable. Oh, yeah? Hold this fly for me, family. I should have super fanged. I don't know why I've been doing this every single time. I said now scavenger. I use a move that's not super fang and realize probably should have super fanged. Because it's not going to kill. Is it? Is it? No, it's not going to kill. The cotton spore. Uh, slow it down. It's either going to slow it down or lower attack. Okay, it slowed it down. Until we hit zero, our power is limitless. I'm not giving up yet. Hold this crunch for me, fam. Worry seed, which means it's runaway ability. It just got improved. Go ahead. Go ahead, Team Snaps and Claps. Proud of every single one of you on this day. I'm proud of you all. I I can't I can't believe it. Even though I was defeated, I won't change my course. I will continue battling until I stand above all trainers. Now move on and experience the true ferocity of the Elite Four. We made light work. Of will, y'all. I'm actually, I'm actually very proud of Team Snaps and Claps on this day. If you guys enjoyed this episode of us taking on the Elite Four with them Pokemon Soul Silver, and would love to see more, then all you have to do is hit that red button below this video. And that's our subscribe button. And I'll do my best, do my best to make sure you guys get to see more episodes of games like Pokemon Soul Silver, more challenges like a Nuzlocke run, as well as everything else that all play has to offer. Thank you, adventurers, for checking this out with me, and I'll catch you later with more. Here on Alt Play. As one member of the Elite Four down. One member. How y'all doing? Everybody's good? I'll heal up smells between now and the next episode, and then we'll be back tomorrow, guys. I'll see you later.